Mourners gathered in Patterson for the wake of an 18-year-old honor student. CBS 2's Thalia Perez has more now on the teen who was killed by stray gunfire while bringing groceries to his grandmother. Wearing pendants with the photo of their late nephew Robert Quadra and holding hands, Sister Alexandra Santiago and Kira Jimenez remember their nephew who lost his life at just 18 years old. Everybody was just so touched by his life. So I think that the one takeaway that we can always take from him was that his presence made all of our lives better. His wake was held at the Scalieri Arnold Funeral Home. Dozens of family and friends were seen filing inside. Seen like his preschool teachers coming, like all throughout elementary school. His the students that he was taking the upward bound program came, the director of the program. Quadra, who was a senior at Harp Academy, was excited to attend Montclair State University on a scholarship in the fall. Santiago says it was his hard work and humble, selfless spirit that left a lasting impression on everyone who crossed his path. But life had other plans. On January 19th, he was caught in the crossfire when two groups of men opened fire. His family says he was unloading groceries from the car for his grandmother in front of 130 Godwin Avenue around 6.30 p.m. Three men were arrested. They're facing multiple charges, including first-degree murder. One thing about Robert was if you asked him to do something, it wasn't a, oh, can I wait a minute? It he was he won't think right about away. Himself. He does what he needs to do for the family. And that day showed exactly who he was. In Patterson, New Jersey, Thalia Perez, CBS 2 News.